friends, I'm Miss Evie from the Stone Monroe Falls Public Library and today we are going to have fun counting our snacks. The snack I have is M&M's. If you pick up a September packet of activities from the library, it will include M&M's for you to use in this activity. But if your grown-up would prefer that you have a chocolate-free packet, that's available too. And then you could pick a different snack to use, maybe goldfish crackers or cereal pieces, whatever you like. I have my M&M's. It's important that we make sure we have 20 pieces of snacks, so I'm going to count mine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. 20. Oh, I have more than 20 M&Ms. I'm going to put these aside to eat later. All right, I have 20 M&Ms. The first thing we're going to do is take our 20 snack items and see if we can divide them into two sets that have the same amount in each set. Hmm, I wonder how to do that. Well, I could just go like this. They look about the same. Let's count and make sure. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That set has nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. That is not the same. Eleven is more than nine. This bigger set needs to get smaller and the smaller set needs to get bigger. I'm going to take one M&M and put it over here. Let's count them again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, Ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now each set has the same number in it. That was fun. Push them all back together again. Now we're going to try and make three sets. That's a lot harder. Hmm, what's a good way to do that? Oh, I know. I'm going to pretend I'm having a party. I'll get three plates. One, two, three. And invite two friends. I'll invite Tiny Fox and Tiny Gnome. There they are. And this is how I'll divide my snacks. One for you, one for you, one for me, two for you, two for you, two for me, three for you, three for you, three for me, four for you, four for you, four for me, five for you, five for you, five for me, six for you, six for you, six for me. Uh-oh, I only have two M&Ms left, but I have three plates. I can't make the amount on every plate the same. Hmm. Oh well. Let's put them all back together, and this time we'll try it with four. I'll get another plate. Here's another plate for my friend Chipmunk. Let's try again, dividing this time into sets of four. One for you, one for you, one for you, one for me. One for you, one for you, one for you, 
one for me, one for you, one for you, one for you, one for me, one for you, one for you, one for you, one for me, one for you, one for you, one for you, one for me. We used up all our M&Ms. Are they the same? One, two, three, four, five. 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 All our sets have the same amount in each one. That is so cool. If you'd still like to count some more, you could dump all your snacks back out and try it with five sets. But if you've had enough counting for today, it's time for snacking. Mm. I hope you had as much fun counting and snacking as I did. See you next time. Mm.